What's going on guys? This is Adam from Ismodis. First off, with recent reports of unsafe vape devices and battery explosions shedding a negative light on our community, we want to help by improving the quality of our products, as well as giving everyone the tools in which they become more knowledgeable for their safety. Most of these recent incidents are caused from damaged battery cells, unsafe vaping devices, and most importantly, fake batteries. So I'm here today to introduce you our new battery analyzer. This is a D500-TY and how important this is to shops and customers alike. First off, this battery analyzer is used to provide information regarding discharge current, mod capacity, and internal resistance, along with being able to recharge your batteries. You're able to test your battery's electrical performance. Now keep in mind, a device like this usually costs around a neighborhood of $30,000. Since you want everyone to have one of these, stores or customers alike, it needs to be at an affordable price point. We want our battery analyzer to reduce the amount of unsafe batteries on the market and we believe it is a strong step towards safety. Vape shops can test batteries they purchase to make sure they are reliable for their consumers. Our main concern is your safety. Knowing your battery's potential can prevent batteries from damaging your devices but keep in mind, this battery analyzer is not 100% accurate, but it will be able to give you a very clear idea of the electrical specs of each of your batteries. So warning labels here, do not use any batteries which casings are warped or if their wrapping is damaged, it won't give you that clear of an idea. The batteries need to be in very good condition. Um, if you or your shop is able to get one of these D500-TYs, we recommend you take great caution with your batteries and your device to ensure the community stays strong for years to come. So I'll go in here and show you all the modes, buttons, and see if we can get something to work out of this thing. So right now we have a grade A clone battery. Um, this You'll find these batteries on any vape shop. Sometimes they won't even know they're selling clones or the legitimate copies of these batteries. So right here I'm gonna go into the charge function. So on the top left you see the highlight that says charge. Right now the battery is at about 3.4 volts and rising. I go and start it up. It's about 50% charged. Okay, 51% give or take. So you can see right here it's charging right here. Gives you each voltage percentage wise down to a very, very accurate scale. So let's go and stop that real quick. Switch over your max current. So this right here is going to give you the max current for your battery. Keep in mind the battery is around 50%. Right now it's a little bit less. We go and start it off right here. All right. So out of the 3.5 or so volts that we have on here, the max amperage that I'm able to produce out of this battery is around 4.2 amps. So I'm going to switch over to capacity. So right here, this one may take you a little bit longer than normal or something that you're used to. Um, this, bat, this does discharge your entire battery. So if I go and start this right here, I'll show you a quick example. Right now it's going to discharge the battery and it'll, to, it'll tell you how much milliamps you have available for this battery type as well as how long it'll take to discharge this battery. This will give you a good idea of how long you're, you can be out in the road vaping and see how long your battery can actually last. So, let's go ahead and stop that for a minute. So this is going to tell you your internal resistance for your battery. This is the safety point that we wanted to bring across. If your battery is damaged in any way, the cells inside your battery is damaged, you have dead cells, anything like that, you can go and start this up. Right there, your internal resistance is 128. So each battery will have different specs, different resistance, um, different components inside. Most of them are going to be the same, lithium ions, but this will give you a clear idea of how safe your battery is for vaping use. So your internal resistance, you want to make sure your battery is not overworking itself. You want to make sure it's safe in a controlled environment. So going through all these presets, you can do all your setups and changes. Say you know your voltage of your battery, you can change everything here. So, you know, set up your set up your voltage, enter, select capacity, 
You can switch up here as well. We'll have more of the instructions in the manuals, more of the instructions in the packaging when it comes in, just so it have a better idea of how safe you want to be with your batteries. We want to make sure this community stays strong for quite a, quite a few more many years and we believe this is one of the next steps into staying strong for quite a while. We want to thank you all for your support and feedback over the years. This has helped us develop something like this in regards to help, helping us stay safe while on the road, while out on the go. Even vape shops who have much knowledge about their batteries may not have one of these. But now this is definitely going to be an opportunity for those shops to provide this for the consumers. We want to keep producing more reliable devices and help raise the community's awareness for years to come. Thank you.